high-level wrestler here tonight, and the opposition knows what's coming, but more often than not in the UFC, they've been unable to stop. It's because since a little boy, he spent his life on the wrestling mat. And even though you start to prepare for it late, you cannot match his ability to train, his ability to focus, the idea that once he gets a hold of you, it only ends with him in top position. It does not matter if he has to get a high crotch. It does not matter if he needs to get a single leg or a double leg. The purpose is to get you to the floor, and he has been trained his entire life to do just that. Yeah, you put it well. He's got a lot. Ready? Underway, and when he sat down with him on Thursday, he understood the grappling challenge he was up against. But he's not afraid to engage on the ground tonight. It's a danger that is not worth risking. It is something that you don't want to play with. This grappler is that good. When this fight gets to the ground, you enter his world, especially when it looks like you hold the advantage on the feet. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Head off the center line, slips the punch. All right, early round one here. Big reach advantage, DC. We'll see if he can employ that patented jab. Yes, he has to maintain distance. He's the taller guy. So every time his opponent tries to enter, he's going to have to take something on the way inside. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. And he landed the right hand there. Nice hook. It's a big knee. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Misses with that punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Huge block there. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, what a punch. Oh, nice. Beautiful hook. Oh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Throwing that jab, no good. Looking for the takedown, he gets it. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom, and if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes in your opponent. Close guard. And he's back to his feet. Good sign for him there. Great punch. The Korean Superboy gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, beautiful hook. Looking to land the right just out of range. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Burrell. Single collar tie. Let's get that takedown. Nice punch here. <laughs> nice one, two there. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Just misses with that big right hand. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Look at the good action that comes from him throwing that kick. Just misses with a left hook there. Shot. 
big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? All right, he engages in the single follow tie. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. DC. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially, but now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. The Korean Superboy gets tattooed by that straight punch. Tries the flying knee to no avail. Throws the right hand there. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? All right, Let's second go. round underway. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Choi. Big punch lands through the middle. Very nice leg kick there by Choi. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh! Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Nice punch there by Shaw. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. And they separate. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Well, just exhausting watching some of these takedown attempts, he's unable to get it there and he's attempting him over and over again how long before he gets discouraged and accepts that this is gonna be a stand-up fight. And both guys really throwing with authority. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Pretty good right hand. Nice loop of punch. He's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Choi. He loaded up on that right hand, too. How about that shin? Oh, Barra's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Whiffs on that offering. Nice leg kick land. Oh, and he gets tagged. Nice combination there, and might not be a bad idea for the opposition to just tweak that head off yeah. the center line. He was landing once before, now he's throwing everything in combination, and they're all landing. Try to establish that jab. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, that is a nice straight punch by him there. He's got it all going tonight. No wasted actions, no loopy punches. He's going right to the target. 
came up inches right Sell there, you. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, that's a nice strike. All right, he lands a hook there, DC. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. When you throw a hook, it can go around the guard of your opponent. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back going. He's having a hard time building his way back into this fight. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Able to check that kick as well. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Right hand punch the clinch. The Korean Superboy gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. They continue to exchange. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, DC, here we go with our next round. It wasn't just the accuracy, it was the aggressiveness, the volume. It was unbelievable to watch him be so active. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. He's giving him so many different things right now. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. He blocks the punch. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. Beautiful punch. Oh, Barrow's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Look at the turtle in that kick. Oh, lands a left punch there, and a lot of it's set up by good footwork. Really great footwork and setting traps so that he can land that beautiful left hand. Oh, and he lands that Knee, that's gonna leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, you might get a finish here in the not too distant future. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Now we're going. Taken down by Burrell. Three minutes to go in round three. Well, he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by Choi. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Close guard. Back to the feet now. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Look at him drive his shin into the opponent's body with that body kick. Wow! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him. What a performance! You knew if he landed that weapon.
happened repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Well, hard to perform Ladies much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout the under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Playing the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl. So there he is, the man of the hour. What a 